Wow, I've had a great week here in Turkey. Just check, I'm uh, at my balcony. There is the ocean. Yeah, you can just see a little bit of it. I'm in the shade. So today we're gonna talk about pricing. Pricing, and we had some questions. Um, first of all, my name is Tineke Rense. I'm from Powerful Business Academy and I help business women to scale and grow their business and double their income within a year or less. And guaranteed, <laughs> yes. So today um, we had a few questions. One of the questions is Helen and Helen says, listen, I cannot ask the price that I need to ask uh, for my material, my time, equipment, because people are not prepared to pay, to pay that price. So there's a few things here, Helen. Um, it's usually never about the price. Um, it's about how people value your product. Um, and that's the way it looks. Um, does it look high class if you want to ask the price that you uh, need? Uh, usually it is the case of you being able to sell something. Now, I've been to sales trainings and people can sell a nickel for a hundred dollars. So it really is how can you tell the story? Do you believe your product is worth that much? And how are you going to, um, to, to, to create your story around it? What words are you going to use? So first of all, it's about you. Do you believe it's worth that much? Do you believe you are worth that much? And then it's what words are you going to use? And ultimately, um, it does look, it does need to look good. It does need to look worthy of what people are going to pay for it. But that's never the first thing, all right? We had a question from Christina and Christina asks me, I have a new brand of products and I want to put it in a market. Should I put it lower uh, in the beginning compared to an established competitor? And on the, on the other side, she says, but I don't want to uh, be cheap. Yes, it's always good to do research. It's always good to check what do other people ask. And it, it depends, is it a product or is it a service? With a service, it usually doesn't matter what price you ask because there's no comparison. There's no you, you can always package it different. So there's, there's nothing to compare it with. If it's about products, yeah, people do want to, uh, want to compare. But if it's a product which is not out there, then you can ask anything you want. If it's exactly the same product as someone else is offering, then people are going to look for it online and they will compare. And then, yeah, it does matter. You, you say you don't want to be uh, cheap. No, no, of course not. So you, you, you shouldn't be, right? Another question, just a second. How to sell a high price item? I've been talking about this a lot. Uh, high price items, it's, well, if it's a product, look, look at what Apple does. Uh, I, I use a lot of Apple products. Um, yes, they are good, but are they really worth that much money that we pay for it compared to other products? I don't think so. So they've created a hype around it. It's the design, it's the, the, the story, it's the, the creating the one thing when people, uh, when they launch something new. So you can sell everything at high price. But again, I told this in the beginning, it's, it's about how you craft a story around it, how you package it, how you design it. Um, and that it doesn't matter if that's a product or a service but it should be something unique. As soon as you're uh, selling a lipstick and it's exactly the same lipstick from the same brand, then you can't change the prices unless you add something else with it. All right, another question. What to consider when pricing an item? So yeah, you should consider a lot of things. You should consider your time. You should consider the possibly the, if it's a product, the shipment. Um, the packaging, the ordering, but also the, the systems that you use. Uh, if it, maybe you use advertising budget. Um, there's a lot of things you need to consider and that you need to add to, uh, to create a good price. So the last question is, should research be included? Marketing, advertising budget? Yes, all of them should be included. 
if you do want to uh, know more about how you can sell high price, do consider have a, having a call with me. You know, <laughs> I always help my people uh, asking higher prices and it always works. So if you pay me, yeah, I'm, I'm not cheap, but uh, compared to what the kind of money that you're gonna make, it's a bargain. So think about it. Schedule a 15 minute call with me to check if I can help you, to check if I think you're a right fit for me to work with you. And if that's the case, we can take it from there. There's no obligation. The 15 minute call is free. I cannot sell you my products in 15 minutes. I won't do that. Um, so you don't have to be scared. Um, it's just going to be a great call. So I look forward to uh, the next live meeting, which is next week. Have a great time. Bye bye.